Who won? Me, Jimmy Hopkins. That's who. Who won? You. Who? Jimmy Hopkins. Correct. That's right, ladies. Me. I'm the daddy now. You treacherous little snake. You think you're tough, huh? You don't need any more of this, Johnny. You laugh at me? You turn on me? You get it on with that harlot who I... I love? Oh, I'm gonna destroy you! All right, calm down, man. It's cool. You lost. No big deal. We can all be friends. You're done, kid. Finished! I'm sorry, I'm sorry! Think I'm dumb? <laughs> Who's dumb now? I fell from five flights and I feel good. I know you're out there. that a wrap yeah you want to get a c785 then dismantle it and recouple with a 767 in titanium very expensive but it will make your machine fly that's what the pros do really i was gonna get the 976 because i thought it would make me look important amongst my peer group a 976 what are you a girl Oh, here's the kid who won the race. Hey. You came for your trophy, huh? Yep. Here she is. Beautiful. Molded plastic, covered in aluminum wrap, with your name misspelled on it. Excellent. Great. Look at this. A bunch of guys whose career aspirations are to work in stores. Fabulous. I love it when people know their place in life. <laughs> <laughs> well, your place in life is in my toilet. You trust fun turd? Do you even have flushing toilets in your trailer? I couldn't imagine it. You guys are a bunch of scumbags, aren't you? What you got? Bring it. Come on. Nice trophy. Hey, let me see. Come on. Hey, <laughs> give me that back. She would have left in it.
We gotta teach that Edgar kid a lesson. Ah, uh, we've got the old Jimmy back. That kid is a lunatic. I bet if we knock some sense into him, he'll turn on Gary. All right, what's the plan? It's really complicated. Great. Yeah, I march in there and beat the crap out of him. Ah, uh, well, at least it's subtle. That's right. Ah, Hopkins. Now, I'm not one to give in to popular sentiment. You can tell that by your clothes. What? I'm saying you dress great. Irrelevant. As I said, I am not a people pleaser, but in your case, I'm going to make an exception. An exception? Cool. Yes, you are without a doubt the least popular boy in this school right now. Even that fat child who wets himself is more popular than you. Coincidentally, it has also come to my attention that you are a filthy, dirty, foul-mouthed, awful little vandal. Yeah, well, we already knew that. Very droll. A comedian till the end. Well, you'll have to pursue your comedic talents elsewhere, boy. Bullworth is not for you. I'm not the one who's funny. You know what's funny? You. You're a joke, you old creep. You and your stuck-up, lame-ass school with its bullies and sex-pest teachers. This place is a dump, and you're a big-nosed freak. This school rewards losers and bullies. I just stand up to them. You painted obscene graffiti on the town hall, boy. I have it on good authority it was you. Oh, yeah? Then who squealed? Tell me that. A commendable pupil did feel the need to tell me you were responsible for this outrage. Gary Smith! Look, I may have painted a few jokes on the town hall, but that kid likes to torture people. Gary Smith is the next head of this school. He's responsible, courteous, and not afraid of being an unpopular leader. You are blind, old man! Blind! And you are leaving! I tried to contact your mother, but she's still off on a cruise. Until I hear from her, I will have to let you stay here in your room. But you may not wear the school uniform uh, or attend classes. Gotta be kidding you are me. leaving the academy to attend to your education elsewhere. Now get out! Whatever, man.